We like Megan Fox like we like our coffee, piping freaking hot. And when it comes to her love life, the romance is just as steamy. So does she swing both ways? Hook up with co-stars? Believe in twin flames? Here's her trail of broken hearts. Oh, I do remember this. Oh, why are you doing this to me? Like most of us, Fox first found romance in her teen years with all the awkwardness and intensity of puppy love. The once aspiring actor started dating her classmate Ben Leahy when she was 15, and the high school sweethearts lasted three years. As Fox recalled to Rolling Stone, Ben was very sweet and wonderful, really tall and big with a perfect body. I loved him. Still, the star was determined to focus on her acting career, so her family moved to Los Angeles. It all proved too much for Leahy, and they eventually split. For his part, Leahy lamented, "...it broke my heart, but I had to let her go. She was way out of my league." I am a god. Around the time Fox scored her first high-profile role in Confessions of a Teenage Drama Queen, she began dating 7th Heaven star David Gallagher in 2003. But their romance was also fleeting. By age 18, Fox was single and ready to mingle. Fox was then briefly linked to a Russian woman named Nikita. As the actor recalled to GQ about that time in her life, I was just careless. I would get myself into situations that were very bizarre, situations any logical person would not have gotten themselves into. Back then, Fox was still new to Los Angeles, and she quickly fell for a woman who worked at the body shop. No, not the lotion retailer, the exotic dance club. She explained, "...I decided that I was going to get her to love me back, and I went out of my way to create a relationship with this girl. I bought her things — perfume, body spray, girly stuff." Claiming that she visited Nikita frequently at the club just to watch her dance, Fox added, "...she was sort of a tough badass, but she'd do these beautiful slow dances to Aerosmith ballads." Despite the generous gifting, the relationship fizzled out after two weeks. An 18-year-old Fox met her future hubby, Brian Austin Green, on the set of the sitcom Hope and Faith in 2004. Fox played a teen daughter on the show, and Green was cast in a guest-starring role. He was around 31 years old at the time and, given their age difference, was hesitant to get into a relationship. But as Fox later told The New York Times, I liked him right away. Brian accidentally touched my leg. I remember literal electricity shooting through me and out of me from every direction. It was like magic." She was so <laughs> obviously smitten. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> the couple announced their engagement after two years of dating. After a sudden split in 2009, the couple reconciled in 2010 and finally got married that June. The duo would go on to have three children together — sons Noah, Bodie, and River. Unfortunately, rumors of trouble bubbled over in the spring of 2020 when Fox and Green were seen without their wedding rings. Green officially confirmed on his podcast that he and Fox had been separated since 2019. They were divorced by 2021. For the record, this short-lived romance took place during a period of separation between Fox and Green. Having starred together in the Transformers franchise during the mid-2000s, Fox and Shia LaBeouf's chemistry sparked an onset romance, or at the very least, a hookup. LaBeouf had hinted as much back in 2011 when he dished to Details magazine, Look, you're on the set for six months with someone who's rooting to be attracted to you, and you're rooting to be attracted to them. I never understood the separation of work and life in that situation, but the time I spent with Megan was our own thing." Is that your girlfriend? Mm-hmm. Ex. Still, their long-rumored relationship wasn't really confirmed until 2018, when Fox opened up about it on Watch What Happens Live. As she revealed to Andy Cohen, I mean, I would confirm that it was romantic. I, lo I love him. I've never been, like, really quiet about that. I, I love him. Yeah. In 2020, a new IT couple burst onto the scene, Megan Fox and Machine Gun Kelly. And the duo quickly took PDA to new heights with a relationship that's so in your face, it spawned some glorious memes. Uh -huh. Don't you dare. <laughs> okay. Only PG-rated answers. Okay. When Fox revealed to British GQ in October 2021 that Kelly's first words to her years prior at an LA party were, quote, I am weed, the jokes pretty much wrote themselves. While neither remembers much from their initial meet-cute, sparks flew when they reunited on the set of indie thriller Midnight in the Switchgrass in March 2020. They were confirmed to be romantically involved by that June and went Instagram official the following month. But no matter how fans may feel about this glitter 
mystery couple, they seem to be in it for the long haul, especially considering he put a ring on it in January 2022. Fox revealed on Lala Kent's Give Them Lala podcast back in July 2020, I knew right away that he was what I call a twin flame. Instead of a soulmate, a twin flame is actually where a soul has ascended into a high enough level that it can be split into two different bodies at the same time. So we're actually two halves of the same soul, I think. And I said that to him almost immediately because I felt it right away. Whatever the case with their bodies, we wish this couple well. And may their twin flames burn forever bright. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebrities are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.